Hey y'all, this is Octavius Gray coming through with another video. I'm calling this Girl Shut Up News. Once again, the shapeshifter known as Demi Lovato is in the news right quick because she doing her druggy ways again. And what I mean by that, here she go with the flip floppity boo. Demi Lovato criticized for adopting she and her pronouns again after rediscovering her femininity. Fluid and you're non-binary and you go by the pronouns they them. Um, for someone like me, I'm still learning what all of that means and I want to be very respectful of the pronouns that people would like to be referred by. But admittedly, the they them, I still don't quite understand. Can you please explain it to me? I've, I've actually adopted the pronouns of she, her again. So for me, I'm such a fluid person. I felt like, especially last year, my energy was balanced and my masculine and feminine energy. So that when I was faced with the choice of walking into a bathroom and it said women and men, I didn't feel like there was a bathroom for me because I didn't feel necessarily like a woman. I didn't feel like a man. Um, I just felt like a human. And that's what they, them is, is about for me. It's just about like feeling human at your core. Recently, I've been feeling more feminine. And so I've adopted she, her again. But I think what's important is like, nobody's perfect. Everyone messes up pronouns at some point. And especially when people are learning, it's just all about respect. Very fluid and you're non- I already read your comment. Masika Kalisha said, now Timmy, Lo <laughs> Timmy Lovato, what y'all not about to do is play pronoun hopscotch. Today, I'm they, them. Tomorrow, I'm she, her. Next, we might be he, him. And demand the people comply to your agenda mood swings. Like, it's one thing to take a stance, but now you're just making a damn mockery. I agree. Demi Lovato after changing her pronouns back to she and her. I am so around. I can't believe I just did that. Facts. Demi Lovato, a grown adult, switching her gender identity every 12 seconds. Meanwhile, children are drilled and surgically mutilated their bodies permanently altered based on their own gender identity declaration, which are even more fickle and subject to change. Now, I agree with this, and a lot of people feel some type of way because a child feel like they are the opposite gender. I still say wait till that child is uh, appropriate age, at least past the age of 16, to see if they really want to live that type of lifestyle because I don't see a few stories of people who has gender reassignment surgery that re uh, regret it and wish they can go back to how they used to be. You know, there's a few of them. You look it up for yourself because at the end of the day, you, you ain't got to take my word for it. But I've seen people say things about they regret doing that. All right. This is why the gender family should not be lumped in with genuine homosexuals. True. They have nothing in common. Straight people will adopt and then drop a non-binary identity over the course of a year like it's a form of queer tourism. Demi Lovato is cashing in on the latest craze for publicity. Except pronoun expect pronoun changes whenever a need for publicity arises. That is also because a lot of things these celebrities do is for clicks and likes. Because uh, many of them are um, bleeding money and and they have extreme high bills. So many of them are really almost broke. So they're going to do anything. You All these little controversies that go out, they're going to do anything to make sure they get their clicks and likes because Publicity, whether good or bad, is still publicity and it still get their name out there. All right. Mary Emily O'Hara. Many non-binary people use multiple pronouns. Lovato said they're using she, her in addition to they, them. It's very common and not a big deal. Please do not insert some kind of reversal or detransition de in there to where, where there is none. Now, how you going to tell us uh, how we feel about something that she said? Because at the end of the day, it is coming off as flip-floppish. A lot of these people who talk about their identities, especially when it comes down to the sexual aspect of it. If you go back, I think it was either Oprah or somebody's TV show. Uh, somebody that had the talk show that were breaking down the um, different orientation that people have. And majority of them sound like bisexuality. Majority of them talk about, sound like bisexuality. And a lot of people talking about they're not gender conforming, but a lot of y'all still come across as being feminine. So which one is, is it? Because to me, and this is my personal opinion, to me, if you're talking about being non-binary and stuff like that, it should be even Steven, in my opinion. It's a mixture of masculine and feminine. Not some man dressed up in some girly clothes and not some woman being a doctor gone masculine in masculine clothing talking about they non-binary and now you just plain dress up that's my opinion you don't have to agree with it but hey whatever so that's the end of that so for real for real y'all can we please mute Demi Lovato because every other month she always opening her mouth and saying something that just eh why she will she claims that she 1% African-American um 
The girl, the girl get publicity off of her drug usage. Look at the last couple of documentaries and look at a, la a few times of her life. So it's just ridiculous, ridiculous, ridiculous to me. So please, Demi Lovato, girl, shut up. As I said, this is girl, shut up news. A lot of these celebrities are spreading their crazy around and a lot of people eat it up. Num, 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 num. Eat it up and follow suit. Stop it. Stop it. Stop following suit with these celebrities. Enjoy their music. Enjoy their little shade. Enjoy the mess they get in. But don't follow them because many of these people are psychos and many of these people are not educated. Because at the end of the day, many of these people are, have been stars since they were children. Or many of these people have dropped out of high school and did not get any type of education for real. And many of these people are out of touch with reality. Like how many, many of us are for real in real life. Because we can't sit, I can't sit up here and talk, talk all the mess about them when we dealing with this stuff in the world as it is because many of us ain't dealing with reality but i just wanted to put this little video out right quick because i know it's been a few days and you know what this little tee hee hee and you see the foolishness so i hope y'all have a wonderful wednesday and i will get back to y'all sometime soon all right like share and comment thank you